Hello everyone and welcome back to uh, Mountain Blade Warband, a Clash of Kings mod. Um, last time we were trying to get back the brother of Osbert Clark, a prominent merchant from Storm's End, who's been captured by kidnappers. We managed to track down the kidnappers hideout and now we're going to raid it and get back his brother. So let's do this. Attack the hideout. Alright, let's go boys. How many men do we have? Not many. Thought we'd have more than this to be honest. Alright, there's the camp. Can you see anyone? There's an enemy. Oh, I hit him! Can't hit him again though. Right, I need to stop using my bow and arrow because I'm crap with it. I've got like no skill in it. Oh, there's a guy there, look. I'm going to take this guy. Come here, come here you bastard. Oh, there's a guy there as well. Huh? Ah! Down. Yeah. Is that victory? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Halbert Clark. Thank you, thank you, sir, for rescuing me from those fiends. Did my brother in Storm's End put you up to their track? Yes, I told him that I would find you. I advise you to return to your family as quickly as you can and be careful on the road. Alright, sweet. So we've got quite a bit of loot from that. The music's still very intense for some reason. Uh, is any of this worth taking? Worth taking? No. No. Wow, they've got a lot of stuff. Holy crap! That was plus 11 right there, so that's better than mine. Uh, um... Cabbages, we may as well take it, it's free food. Fish is also free food, bread's free food. Not bothered about the bow. Those axes are, ooh, that one's better than mine, that hatchet. I uh, can't even use that. Butter, that's free food. Honey, we can sell that. Fine sausages is free food. The rest we'll just have to leave. Too much effort to carry all that stuff around. Alright, so we best return back to Storm's End and tell Osbert that we saved his brother. Oh, it's getting dark. Alright, we're back. We'll go We'll go to the marketplace first and sell some stuff. So, arms merchant, we're going to sell that and that and that and that. And that. And that. I don't think it actually makes a difference who you sell the stuff to. To be honest. So we'll sell this honey. We'll just sell everything. Let's do it. If it does make a difference, then somebody let me know. But as far as I'm aware, it doesn't. And we got nearly 500 coins from that. Alright, head back. Visit the tavern. Osbert's still here. Of course. Well, my brother is home safe. I'm not sure what to do with him. Maybe pack him off to Old Town. Or have him join the brothers on the Quiet Isle. That way, if he gets knocked on the head in a street brawl, no one can say it's my fault. But that's not your problem. Here's the rest of your reward. It's well earned. The money is most welcome. I'm glad to be of your service. Wow, that helmet looks stupid. Good. Now you are interested in making... Are you not... I can't speak. <laughs> now are you interested in making some more? Possibly. What do you need? Well, I'm not going to read all that because it's long. But basically, he's asking if I remembered that he said... Um, originally, he said he reckons somebody um, in the Guardsmen is letting bandits into the town to like kidnap people in exchange for like a bribe. Um, and he reckons he's found out that it's the head of the, the Guardsmen. So he's asking for us to try capture him. You leave the tavern and go out to the streets, looking nervous. Nervous looking young men are waiting in every street corner. You can see they have daggers and clubs concealed under their clothes. And I catch a mixture of fear. Oh, I'm going to start again reading that. You leave the tavern and go out to the streets. Nervous looking young men are waiting on every street corner. You see, you can see they have daggers and clubs concealed under their clothes and catch a mixture of fear, anticipation and pride in the quick looks they throw at you, if you pa as you pass by. Praying that your enemies have not been alarmed by this all too obvious bunch of plotters, you check your weapons for one last time and prepare yourself for the action ahead. Okay. 
All right, we're in the town. I really need a shield. All right, boys. It's time, lads. Up and at them. Oh, oh, shit. No, 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 no. Two on one is not fair. Yes, this guy's coming to help. I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get killed here. Ow. Right, that's that guy down. Oh, I'm on really low health. Without a shield, it's really hard to take on guys that don't have... Ah, oh, God, I'm going to die. There's so many of them. Run. That guy had a shield. I'm going to pick it up. No, I died just as I picked up the shield. Ah. Oh. You fall down with the last blow, unable to move, trying hard not to pass out. Soon the sounds of fighting filling the streets gives way to cheers of the townsmen. You realise the relief that your side won the day. Soon friendly arms pick you up from the ground and you let yourself drift off to a blissful sleep. Hours later, later you wake up in the merchant's house. Well, I did appallingly there. Look at my health, it's so low. Ah, you're awake, Rostam Snow. You took quite a blow there. But, good news, we defeated them. And you did some real damage before you went down. If you hadn't been there, it could have gone very badly. I'm grateful to you. Unfortunately, about ten of my lads got themselves injured. I should go and look on them. Ah, well, I guess I don't mind a blow taken in a good cause. Um, I'm not going to read all that. I think he's just saying he's going to tell the king about all this and try expose the, um, the traitor. So, we're going to leave. And what we're going to do is we're going to head out and set out on recruiting some more men. So, where haven't we been yet? Um, we haven't been to Ashton. Let's let's venture over to Ashton. We've got 15 men and four captives with us. We need more men though. That's the thing. We need more. Oh, loot is 19. They'd probably take me. There's more of them. Can I upgrade anyone? I can upgrade five of these to uh, spearmen. So I've now got quite a decent little set of spearmen. That's always a good start. Right, where are we riding to Ashton? We need some more men. There's a tawny field there. Alright, recruit peasants. Only one. That's not very good. Um, could ride over to this... Charcoal Hill, a village of the Vale is this? Oh no, the Reach. Why do I keep getting the Reach and the Vale mixed up? Ashford. It's a big town as well there. Let's head down to Ashford. See if there's anything interesting there. Might be able to find ourselves a quest or something. The music's strange. I haven't heard this before. Alright, let's see if my character's ready to upgrade. Nope. While we're riding. I'm also quickly going to check the mod options. Yeah, these these have reset. This should be set to 150. Um, so we can get the biggest battles possible. And we want the reinforcement waves to be up to like 50. Right, done. Zoom travelling. Options. Uh, battle size 150. That still kept the same, right. So let's carry on riding down to Ashford. Are these held by the Stormlands? I think they are. Elmwood and things like that. Blackhaven, yeah, the Stormlands. Alright, so we can check out some of these towns. There's quite a few, actually. Look at the desert of the uh, the Dornish. Never really been down here. I don't really know much about the Dornish. Ah, seems interesting. Ah, we're at Ashford. Right, let's visit the tavern, see if we can find a slave trader to sell these captives. Two-hander. And then the tavern keeper. Nope, nothing. Oh, look at that. <coughs> Alright, sorry about that. I just had a sneezing fit. Ah, oh, God. Veteran leech reach levies. Sir, do you have need for sell swords, sir? I am looking for a master. We'll join you for 36 dinars. Just for one of you, I'm not really interested. <laughs> Let's go to the marketplace. 
Uh, we don't really have anything else to sell now. We've just got food left. So, oops, we'll head back and then we will visit the streets and we'll try to find the guildmaster. He might have a quest for us. <laughs> Hello. Who are these guys? Reach Glaveman. Townsmen? They're women. Just saying, not townsmen. The screen's tearing really bad. I don't know if this is picking up in the recording, but on my end it is. Hello? Where's the guildmaster? Every town has a guildmaster. Door to the dungeon. He's a prison guard. The guildmaster has quests and stuff like that. <laughs> um, Jump up here. Aha. Could be up here. Guildmaster? There he is. Hello, stranger. You seem to be new to Ashford. I'm the guildmaster of the town. Um, let's, let's ask him if he has a job for us. You're looking for a job? Actually, I was looking for someone to deliver some local ale. Perhaps you can do that. Yeah, I can do that. I have a cargo of local ale that needs to be delivered to the tavern in Lorath. If you can take eight units of local ale to Lorath in seven days, you may earn 470 dinars. That's pretty good. What do you say? All right, I'll make the delivery. All right, I'm counting on you. Good luck. Right, so we'll leave the town. And we have to find Lorath. Lorath. Where is Lorath? Um, Lorath? Can anyone see it? Lorath. Please don't tell me it's like on the other side of the world. Lice. Volantis is there. <laughs> I know what I can do. I can go in notes. And then Lorath. Where's it? Where is it? Uh, Halek Bala of Lorath. I'm guessing it's over this side then, over the, uh, over to the east. Which is, who will fall out was it then? Uh, Lorath. Why does it have to be so far? Hey, look, Moss. Ha <laughs> Moss Isley. Um, Lorath? Anyone? Have I gone past it or something? Oh, there it is, Lorath. It's on an island. <laughs> Alright, this is a long damn journey, Jesus. I'll zoom back in. There's a melee being held by Lord Patrick. Somebody over there, I didn't even read that. Oh my god, this is a long way. How long do we have to do this quest? Because I know you only get like, set time limits. Uh, uh, notes. Seven days, shit. We best ride. Onwards. Got a big shipment to make. Alright, I'll stop recording and start again if anything interesting happens or when I get there. Oh, I just got to a village just not far from Lorath, the place we're actually meant to be going, and it's actually under attack by bandits, so um, let's clear this place out. 13 forest bandits area. <clears throat> I actually saw a, f uh, th a few Dothraki when I was riding around in this area, so the Dothraki are in the game, which is cool. Alright, I'm just going to charge. That's yeah, scared. Quite a lot of them, though. Oh my god, there's quite a lot of them. I'm scared. Turn back, turn back. Get him, boys. Alright, I'm getting off the horse because it's... Whoa, someone just stuck my horse with an arrow. Jesus. Ah Such a crazy melee. I need a shield. I need a shield. Yeah, I got a shield, even though it's slightly damaged. Ow, got hit by an arrow. Ah, ow. Get him. <laughs> oh my god. So many guys. Ah. There's more? Ah, archers. Look at that archer, he's doomed. You're doomed.
Get in, boys. Yeah! Victory! We just saved a village as well. Battle won. We have... Oh, I just got that Lorathi archer. I recruited him from a nearby village and he's dead. I'll take... Oh, wow, they gave me no reward. That's shit. Uh, recruit peasants. Two Lorathi archers. I'll take them. Alright. I may as well carry on recording since I'm right here. But, um... It's actually taken me five days to get this far, which is a long time. It took, it's, it's taken me at least a good ten minutes of, like, sitting here waiting for my guy to get there. Ah, recruit peasants, one more archer. And then Lorath is right there. Uh, the boat's a bit glitched. We shouldn't be in a boat. Let's go into Lorath. We'll deliver our message. Hello. Oh, there's a melee here and a feast, uh, but we're not interested in that. We're going to... Uh, I don't really want to join the feast. I'm not allowed to a feast. Visit tavern. Who am I meant to be taking this to? Oh, to the tavern. Tavern keeper. I was told to deliver you eight units of local ale. Yay! Alright. Loth Lorathi Archer, Elite Sellsword Pikeman, Walter the Scholar, and Grasmak Mosenko. This guy trains Unsullied, and you can buy Unsullied from him, but they're expensive, obviously. Right, so, well, I'm here, I'm going to sell up and do some other things, like sell some stuff, get some food, maybe, and then I'll probably start making my way back to the mainland. So, I'll end this episode here. Thanks for watching, everyone, and I will see you all next time.